on payday, you feel like a millionaire. Hold on, designer stores, today you are getting cleaned out. A barely noticeable scratch on your phone? No big deal, not for a shopaholic. A new phone, and not just any phone, but the newest iPhone is her <sighs> biggest dream. It's a real obsession. She can't be happy without it. Well, finally, it's happening. She's buying a new iPhone. It's amazing how easy it is to say goodbye to her savings for an impulse purchase. Yay. Of course, she always lives to the fullest and never saves money. I feel bad for victims of capitalism. And a girl with a more economical approach won't just switch gadgets like that, especially when she sees the prices. Excuse me, how much did you say it costs? No, thanks, my phone is still just fine. Big whoop, the screen cracked, it's still working. Sometimes the temptation to go to a cafe is so strong. But if you remember about happy hour, you can really save some money. Hmm. And get all the same stuff, but a little cheaper. Besides, coffee on sale seems much more fragrant than regular coffee. And you can also use free sugar and napkins. That'll always come in handy. But this girl lives by the principles of right here, right now, and I want everything at once. Give me this and that, and also this. That's a lot! But the card will handle it all. As long as there's money on it, of course. The worst part is when the order comes in and you don't really need it anymore. Hmm. You just threw oh. money away. Oh no! The mug is covered with a layer of tea stains. I wonder if I can even wash it out. Oh, here comes a life hack. Take an old toothbrush and a lighter. Heat the toothbrush and bend it like this. You got a handy cup brush. A little effort and some dishwashing liquid and the plaque disappears right in front of your eyes. This innovative gadget took care of everything. What a beautiful mug. But the mug isn't as lucky if it's owned by a big spender. When she sees stains on it, she just throws it away. Really, what's the big deal? I can just buy a new one. Here's a life hack from people who know how to save. You'll need some paper envelopes. Write the purpose of money on each one. For example, food, travel, home, entertainment. Now distribute the money into the envelopes. This is a very helpful tool to keep your money in order. And you won't waste your whole paycheck in one day. And what about the big spender? Finally, my paycheck! I feel so rich, I can buy whatever I want. No envelopes, why? I'll just stuff the money in my purse. No strategic planning here. Most of the money goes right in my pocket so I can spend it right away on whatever catches my fancy. Did she lose some bills? This big spender won't even notice it. A special passion of a shopaholic is online shopping. I need those loafers right now. And these stylish boots. And these too. She is so caught up that she orders several pairs of shoes. Some clothes? Of course! She had to spend a lot of money. And her financial reserves are a little weakened. Well, that's fine. It's all for my favorite person. Myself! And what do people who know the value of money do? My favorite sneakers are worn out. It's a shame. I'm going to have to buy new ones. But first, let's make a shopping plan. Fit new sneakers into it. Like this. No unplanned spending. You can make delicious sandwiches at home and take them with you to class or to work. Just like a salad. That's what lunch boxes are for. 
Well, big spenders don't want to bother. Just the thought of vegetables that need cooking makes them sad. Isn't it easier to get delivery? One, two, three! And there's delicious food on the table! It's not cheap, but it's easy! Sales, sales! That's a shopaholic's favorite word! You have gotta run or it'll be all sold out! And you won't get anything! Phew! You got a lot of stuff with some great deals! But the thrifty girl has much stronger willpower! And no sales will make her spend money just like that! A shiny party dress? Habwa! You are not on my shopping list! 50% off? Nah! Don't get your hopes up! That's what strong self-control means! Sometimes you come home after running around in your sneakers all day and… You smell terrible! It's your socks! They really stink! Why bother? You can just throw them away! And you can buy new ones! Yeah, that's what a girl who's not used to saving will do! And what about her frugal friend? That kind of issue could happen to anyone! But the solution would be very different! The socks aren't going to the trash can! They are going to the laundry! The washing machine will do the job! It's so chilly outside! And it's snowing! And I'm not even wearing gloves! Brrr! I don't want to walk at all! That's why the big spender calls a taxi! But the thrifty friend has a different approach! She can skateboard too! It's so cool to ride in the snow and breathe fresh air! And it's way cheaper! Well, lazier and richer girls jump into a cozy taxi! Yeah, you can't keep them from doing their thing! Saving up is important even when it comes to the smallest things! You know when the tube seems to still have a little toothpaste left in it, but you can't squeeze it out? Roll the tube towards the end and squeeze it! That's how you can use up all the toothpaste! Very economical! You can deal with a tube of lotion, too! You just have to cut it open and scoop out everything that's left! And if there's a little left in a bottle of shampoo, you can pour some water into it and shake it up! There you go! That's enough for a couple more washes! But not everybody's going to be so excited! Is the shampoo empty? And the toothpaste is running out? This is a great excuse to buy fresh beauty products! I might even fill the whole bathroom with nice new bottles! And at the same time, I'll buy a lot of unnecessary products! But why? Looks like even she doesn't know! The ability to create a new outfit from random things is a very useful skill! It'll even protect your budget! One beautiful scarf, and you can come up with a few interesting looks at once! The art of combining accessories and clothing lets you always look new! All it takes is a few elements and good taste! And there is absolutely no need to fill your closet with a lot of things! But it's different for a shopaholic! All these clothes and nothing to wear? What a paradox! She goes through different clothes! No matter what she does, it doesn't look right! And the clothes don't match! Well, will she have to spend money on going shopping again? Come on, there's no such thing as too many clothes! It's so nice to leave the mall without all these bulky bags! You can put everything you need in one reusable shopping bag! And the big spender has to carry all these bags! It feels like the more you have in your hands, the better! Well, of course! It's so cool to put each purchased fruit in a separate, fashionable eco-package! No common sense! And no savings! And there is obviously no caring about the environment, either! And here we are at the end of the month! And what's in our shopaholics wallet? It's completely <sighs> empty! Oh! A crumpled dollar! Right on time! And there's our thrifty girl! I think she's going to be fine! What can 
I say? Spenders and frugal people live on different planets. Which one of these categories do you belong to? Sound off in the comments. And don't forget to click like, subscribe to our channel, and click on the bell so you don't miss even more interesting sketches and life hacks from Troom Troom Select.